Welcome back to Music News TV. This is Tim Hunter. Today's music news, R&B sensation, legendary, uh, I may add, R. Kelly. is uh, seems to be, I don't know, it seems like he's brewing up um, a big concern to a lot of the parents out here. Um, R. Kelly is actually being accused of something that's very interesting. They're accusing him of actually starting some type of cult, uh, to say the least. Uh, now that no, now this is not any type of criminal charges that's been processed against them, at least not a, as of yet. But so far, uh, this is what's going on. Apparently, um, about six different parents has been coming forth and making claims that R. Kelly has actually started a cult that actually seduced the minds of their daughters. And this is how it all went down. Apparently, these parents introduced uh, their kids to R. Kelly, basically their daughters in order to pursue their uh, music careers. Well, R. Kelly, I guess, uh, created a particular bond with these young women, and he's basically has them living either in his homes in Atlanta or in Chicago. Now, according to the parents, he's basically brainwashed these girls. He has them doing everything from reporting. First of all, they're calling him daddy. They, uh, they have to report to him when he they take a bath, uh, when they're eating, what they're eating, what clothes they're wearing, all type of details. And in addition to all of that, apparently they're making an awful lot of sex tapes with R. Kelly. And he's been recording these sex tapes. Now, we don't know the, the age of these women. Apparently they must be over 18 because I'm pretty sure the uh, parents would have filed some type of criminal charges if they weren't. But as you guys know, I mean, R. Kelly even stated on record that as long as the girls are over 18 years old, uh, then he's okay to move forward and have relationships with them. Now, if you guys can remember, not too long ago, less than a year ago, R. Kelly actually was photographed with a new young lady he's been dating on the Atlanta scene, but this young lady was 19 years old. Uh, this is actually kind of uh, rubbed people the wrong way as well because, as you guys know, R. Kelly is now 50 years old. Uh, the 50-year-old hit maker also got a strong history of kind of dealing with younger women. Um, in 1994, he married Aaliyah. Um, to this day, we don't know if that was a real marriage, real relationship, or some type of publicity stunt in order to uh, sell more records. We don't know yet. But in 2008, there was a sex tape. But in the sex tape uh, trial, he was acquitted. It was 14 charges against him. He was acquitted of all 14. So we don't know what happened there or what's the true story behind that. So yeah, keep in mind, a lot of times, there's publicity stumps involved, you know, with artists and so on like that in order for them to move more records or be the talk in media. Because at the end of the day, that's going to convert into curiosity and music sales. So keep that in mind. But at the same time, with these parents, now keep in mind, these are parents we're talking about here. These, this is not some type of legal allegations, at least not yet. Uh, they're saying something very strong about the fact that their kids are being brainwashed by R. Kelly. One of the parents actually went so far as said that she was hugging her daughter after not seeing her for a long time. All her daughter was saying was how much she was in love with R. Kelly. So um, I don't know how to take that because a relationship is a relationship. At the same time, when you're talking about someone's daughter, they know their kids better than anyone else. Now, this is what makes it uh, even more interesting when it comes to the parents making this type of claim. Three women who actually worked with R. Kelly agree with the parents. They're actually saying that R. Kelly got some type of mind control power and he's pretty much mastered mind control and he's using it on these girls. So with that all being said, we have no idea what to think next until they actually bring in, I guess, law enforcement to move forward with some type of investigation there. So as of right now, there is no legal charges against R. Kelly or anything like that. These are just strong claims from the parents of these uh, women there. So as of right now, now that uh, this information is out on the table, we have to wait and see what's going to happen next, whether these women will be returning back home to their parents or if there's going to be any type of legal charges or anything that's going against R. Kelly. But as of right now, there is no legal charges. Apparently, these girls must be over 18 years old, even though they're quite young. And we just don't know what to expect. Maybe this is all a publicity stunt. But hopefully, we'll see in the near future. And until then, we'll keep you posted here at Music News TV as we get more information there. But in the meanwhile, check us out at MusicNewsTV.com, and you can get information faster if you subscribe.